And multiple people on the Treasure Coast are facing jail time. This after police say they took part in a planned street takeover. Treasure Coast Bureau reporter Jesse Carboneri shares the message from police. Police say about 100 cars were a part of it. It happened over the weekend. You can see some of the damage left behind in this parking lot from Saturday night. We just used our intel to uh, understand exactly how many vehicles were in the area and we deployed our resources. It comes after a group of about 100 cars were caught drag racing, doing burnouts and recklessly driving. Several groups were uh, accumulating around the city. Port St. Lucie police say they conducted 24 traffic stops, issued 30 tickets and arrested a total of four people. A lot of our partners down south in the Broward area have dealt with it in a much greater capacity than we have. So we're aware of it. We know that it's trending. We know that it's coming and we've been prepared for it. Those people are facing charges, including street takeover, reckless driving and contributing to the delinquency of a minor. Penalties ranging from a first degree misdemeanor with fines between 500 to $5,000, depending on the number of violations and points on their driver's license. This type of behavior is not going to be tolerated in Port St. Lucie. We're going to deploy all resources available and we're going to put a stop to it. At this point, police have not identified who exactly will be facing charges. Reporting from Port St. Lucie, I'm Josie Carbonari, WPBF 25 News.